Hello, brave people. Let me ask you something. When was the last time you stopped and truly felt grateful? I'm not talking about the casual time, so a quick thought of appreciation. No. I mean deeply felt gratitude. The kind that makes your heart swell. That reminds you of how far you've gone and how blessed you really are. And how much you still have ahead of you. If you haven't done that in a while, then today is a day for you to change that. Gratitude is power. It's more than just a feel good kind of you know idea is a transformative force that can literally change the way we see the world around us it can change the way we see our challenges our adversities and ourselves at large so today i want to talk to you about the power of gratitude and how it can shift your mindsets and perspectives in a way you've never imagined no matter the challenges you are facing right now gratitude has the capacity to unlock the door for you yes so let the power of gratitude change your perspective today. Here is what I need you to understand. Life is all about perspective. It's not what happened to us that define us. It's how we respond to what happened to us. Two people can experience the uh, same set of circumstances, but one will be miserable while the other will thrive in it. Why? Because it's not about what you are going through, actually. It's about what you focused on and gratitude is a lens through which you can see the beauty even in the midst of storm. You see, when you focus on what is missing, what is wrong, what is hard, you are feeding negativity. You are giving power to the very thing that dragged you down. But wait, when you shift your focus to what is right, to the blessings in your life, you flip the script. Gratitude forces you to recognize that despite the challenges, despite the setback, there is something good in your life. And that good thing is where your strength lies. So why should you start cultivating gratitude today? Why should you make it a daily practice? Here is why. Reason number one, gratitude shifts your mindset from scarcity to abundance. Most of us live in a state of scarcity. We are always thinking about what we don't have, what we are lacking, what we need to get in order to feel complete. But gratitude shifts that. Gratitude says, look at what you already have. Look at the abundance in your life. When you start focusing on the things that are already working, the things you are blessed with you begin to realize that you have more than enough actually and from that place of abundance you are able to attract even more and more into your life think about it if you're constantly focused on what is missing you never feel like you have enough no matter how much you achieve or gain but when you focus on what you already have and what is present you will find contentment and peace right here right now and that's when the door of other opportunities open up onto you because you are no longer operating from a place of lack but from a place of abundance number two gratitude turn obstacle into opportunity yes listen life is not easy we all know that we all face obstacles setback disappointment and failure but here is the thing the truth is those very challenges are the seed of your greatest growth and gratitude is what allows you to see that gratitude transform obstacle into opportunity because it forces you to ask what is the lesson here what can i learn from this how can this make me a better person when you practice gratitude even in the face of hardship you stop seeing yourself as a victim you stop seeing life as something that is happening to you and you start seeing it as something that is happening for you that shift in perspective changes everything suddenly every struggle becomes an opportunity for growth every failure becomes a stepping stone towards success every setback becomes a lesson in love and resilience number three gratitude teaches you that nothing is wasted every experience no matter how painful or how little it is it has a value and when you start to see life through that lens there's nothing that can hold you back you become unstoppable because you know that no matter what comes your way there is something good to be gained from it number four gratitude builds stronger relationship let me ask you this question how are your relationship right now whether your family your friends your colleague or your partner how strong or how healthy or how fulfilling are those connections because here is something we all need to understand gratitude is a glue that holds relationship together when you are constantly focused on what is wrong in the relationship you will find more reason to be dissatisfied but when you focus on what is right on the things you appreciate about the person or the people in your life. You strengthen those bonds. Gratitude foster connection. It brings people together because it reminds them of their value. When you express gratitude to the people in your life, you are telling them, I see you, I appreciate you, I'm grateful for you. And those words, those feelings are 
powerful. They can heal wounds, mend broken relationships, and create deeper and more meaningful connections. Here is the kicker. Gratitude in relationship isn't just about them. It's about you. Yes. The more you appreciate the people in your life, the more fulfilled you will feel. The more you give thanks for the love, support, and friendship you have around you, the more joy you will experience in the relationship. How to start cultivating gratitude? Now, I know you might start thinking, this sounds great, but how do I actually start practicing gratitude? It is simple, but it requires consistency. What do I say? Consistency. Here are a few ways and practice to begin incorporating gratitude into your life. First, start a gratitude journal. Yes, every day write down at least three things you are grateful for. They don't have to be a big thing. It can be as simple as a kind word from a friend, the beauty of the sunset, the beauty of the flowers around you, or the fact that you have food on your table. The point is to train your mind to focus on what is good. That is just the objective. Second, express gratitude to others. Take the time to thank the people in your life. Tell them what you appreciate about them. Send a message, make a call, or say it in person. Just let them know that you see their value and you are grateful for their presence in your life. Thirdly, practice mindful gratitude. Throughout your day, take moments to pause and reflect on what you are thankful for. Whether it's during your morning coffee, in the afternoon walk, or before your bedtime, make it a habit to stop and recognize the good thing around you. Turn challenges into gratitude. When you are facing tough situations, ask yourself, what can I be grateful for in this moment? It might be hard at first, but with practice, you will start seeing the silver lining in every cloud. Your journey to transformation starts now. Here is what I want you to remember. Gratitude is not just a feeling. It's a choice. It's a decision you make every single day. No matter what is happening around you, it's a choice to focus on what is right instead of what is wrong. It is a decision to count your blessing instead of your problem. And let me tell you something. That choice will change your life immediately. When you start living in gratitude, you become a magnet for positivity, for abundance, for joy. You will attract more and more blessings into your life. You will attract what you focus on. And when you focus on the good, more good will come your way. So today, I challenge you to start small. Begin by recognizing the blessing in your life, no matter how big or small, and give thanks for them. Watch as your perspective shifts as your life transforms and you become a beacon of gratitude in the world that desperately needs it. Because at the end of the day, it is not happiness that brings gratitude. It is gratitude that brings happiness. And you have the power to choose that happiness right now. Will you choose gratitude today? Write comment. I choose gratitude under the comment section. Thank you. Dummy. 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 Dummy.